one of the effects of, of consuming more vitamin A is that you, uh, you become less uh, susceptible to disease. So in this paper, what we do is we look to see if there's some potential, um, there are impacts on, on disease. And in particular, we're looking at diarrhea prevalence and severity. And we're looking at diarrhea prevalence and severity kind of importantly in a very deficient population, which is this population in, in Mozambique where a lot, on the order of 70% of children were deficient at the baseline before this study took place. So what we find are, are really nice impacts on, on diarrhea prevalence amongst the, the really young children who, are effect, who were affected and we know they had more, more or vitamin A through orange sweet potato in their diet. They become about half as likely to have diarrhea as children in the control group, to have suffered diarrhea in the last 14 days in the, than children in the control group. And what we find in the paper is that that does happen through the consumption of, of orange sweet potatoes. So children who consume more orange sweet potatoes are, actually have less likelihood of having uh, of, of having had a diarrhea episode or, or more than one diarrhea episode. Um, and we also find that the severity drops a bit. So we find a, a reduction in the severity of, of diarrhea as a result, of, again, of the consumption of orange sweet potatoes. So this is really uh, an important finding because, first of all, we're very interested in seeing what the, the nutrition impacts or the health impacts of agriculture could be quite generally. Um, but we don't have, this is really a first in that we rigorously are able to, with a randomized control trial, show impacts on a health outcome through an agricultural intervention, which is a productive intervention. So we're able to show that through producing more food or a different type of food, people are able, we are able to affect health outcomes, a, a specific health outcome, I should say, amongst, amongst uh, young children, which is a, an important result because that really hadn't happened before. It's really gratifying, of course, to see that that there were these these effects. I don't think any of us we didn't you know we didn't power the study to look for uh, changes or reductions in diarrhea uh, prevalence. We powered the study to find impacts on vitamin A intakes, and we're in a sense really pleased to see that there are these these impacts beyond just finding improvements in vitamin A intakes and reductions in vitamin A inadequacy. In a sense, we've been looking for this evidence that agricultural interventions can affect nutrition and health, and here we've, we've got one, which is really nice to have.